Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to upgrade your computer from Windows 11 23H2 version to Windows 11 24H2. As you know that 24H2 gives some updated features like Microsoft Recall and many more. Maybe you want to upgrade your computer from 23H2 to 24H2. First let's see which version we are using. Right click on this PC, go to properties. Over here you can see I am using the 23H2 version. So let us try to upgrade it to 24H2. Now let us go to settings and click on Windows update. If I click on check for updates, you can see I had a pending update for Windows 11 version 23H2. So the download will get completed. Once the download is completed, I have to restart the computer. So you have to basically click on this button to check for any pending updates. If there is any pending updates, you have to download and install all the updates and restart your computer to apply the updates. Now you can see the update is completed. If I go and click on check for updates, it says you are up to date. That means there is no pending update in my computer. So till now it doesn't keep any option to upgrade from 23H2 to 24H2 version. So what you have to do, we have to open the local group policy editor. For that, just press the Windows and R button simultaneously on your computer or you can just click on the search button and type here run and enter. Now here you have to put gpedit.msc, you can see gpedit.msc and hit enter. Let me expand it, double click on administrative template then double click on windows components and here at the bottom you will you will find windows update double click on it then manage updates apart from windows update select this there are several options just select the last option select the target feature update version right click on it and click on edit now click on enable and here put windows 11 Make sure the W is capital right here 24H2. Make sure the H is capital again. Now hit apply. OK. Now you have to restart your computer once. It is very crucial. Now, if you are using Windows 11 home version, then you might not be able to open the group policy editor. In that case, you have to open the registry editor. For that what you have to do, just uh, go to the search bar and type here run and then type regedit, make sure there is no space and click on ok. Once you give the permission, you will see this kind of interface. Now here you have to select hkey local machine, either double click on it or just expand it from here and then go to software, under policies, you will find Microsoft. Then go to Windows and here you have to find the Windows Update. If you don't find the Windows Update key, then you have to select the Windows, right click on it, click on New Key and type here Windows Update, W and U are capitals and hit enter. Now in the blank space, you have to create some string value as well as some D word value. So for that, right click on the blank space. Click on new, select string value, type product version, make sure the P and V are uppercase letters, hit enter, double click on it and then set the value data to Windows 11, W is capital, hit enter and now right click again on the blank space, click on new and select DWAT 32 bit value and then type target release version, hit enter double click on it and change the value data to 1 and hit enter. Now the last value, right click on it, go to new, string value and type target release version info and hit enter. Now double click on it and type 24H2 that is the version code of your Windows 11. So hit enter and now you can close the registry editor and then go to start menu and restart your computer once. 
Once you have restarted your computer, now go to settings, select windows update from the left panel, click on check for updates. Now we can see the Windows 11 version 24H2 is available and it's automatically getting downloaded. So this is the way how you can make the 24H2 version available on your computer if it is not available directly. That's it for today's video. Thank you for watching till the end. See you in the next video. Till then, stay safe.